another little trick that a lot of people don't know about um, is if I take this and I drag it. As you see, I took this, just clicked it, and dragged it over top of the viewport. And when I done that, look what happened down here. Here, here come, here it is. This is that slider. It's in my viewport now. You see, when I slide it, it's adjusting the chair. These are, you can do this with your most important assets. Okay, like now, if I want to control my inset, this will save me from having to go into this inset edit view every time I want to adjust that. Okay, so let's go up here to the poly extrude. Uh, this poly extrude, which one are we looking at here? Looks like we're looking at the feet. Here's the feet. Okay, we can make the feet longer and stuff. Or we can change the inset, which makes them wider and smaller. Let's take this inset and drag it out to our viewer. And here it is down here. Now we have an inset for our feet. We have an inset for our top here. You see? Inset for our feet. And we can also have... Let's see. An inset for our chair. Our cushion there, as you can see. Messes everything all up. And I just wanted to let you know that this is a really handy... Really handy thing here because you can throw these sliders into your viewport and not have to switch back and switch back in between different nodes and dig into your trees to get these nodes. 